Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be unboxing a ton of PR packages. It's the perfect day to do this because it's a no makeup day. I've been organizing and decluttering, so got to get these boxes going. I'm going to be sharing everything that's new in beauty from skincare, makeup, fragrance, body care, all of the above. I haven't done one of these in a couple months, so it's been a minute and I have a lot to show you. So you may want to snack for this one because it's going to be long, but I'm going to show you up close and personal all the new stuff that I have received with a couple swatches here and there but I love to show you guys everything up front and you guys will have to let me know in the comments what you guys want to see me feature in an upcoming video so let's get into this unboxing okay guys so we are starting off with this package from Dermalogica skincare let's see what they sent over here so it looks like they have a new moisturizer which looks really fun let's see so this is their new phyto nature oxygen cream so it's supposed to basically kind of brighten soothe and tighten aging skin and then minimize the look of fine lines and wrinkles so it sounds really good i know dermalogica I know Dermalogica has great ingredients and some great science-backed skincare, so I'm actually quite excited to try this one. It sounds like it's going to be a really good one. Next box here is actually from L'Oreal, and they sent over their new and improved True Match Foundation. So I think they did reformulate a little bit, and then they did change the packaging, which is nice. It says, for the first time, formulated with up to six pigments. So here is how it looks. I love the new bottle. I will definitely be testing this out very soon in a testing new drugstore makeup. I have a lot of stuff that I want to test out for you guys for sure. So be on the lookout for that. Here is a really fun package. This came from Doll10. And this is their new collab with Jen Phelps. If you guys watch her on YouTube, she is one of my favorite channels. She's so informative in her videos. And she has tons of dupe videos and just everything in makeup. She's always very detailed detailed and she has a new brush set with doll 10 okay these handles are beautiful they look like a gorgeous almost galaxy sky with some gold glitter in them and then these are the different shapes she wanted to create like enough to do a full face so there's a couple different face and eye brushes in here i'm so excited to try these but wow they are absolutely gorgeous congratulations jen on the new collab okay i'm gonna throw these in here as well these are some palettes by Wicked Widow, which is a small indie brand. Um, I really wanted to try out their Scissor Hands palette, which is based off of Edward Scissor Hands, of course, and it's stunning. Uh, I wanted to go ahead and swatch this for you. This one you can pre order, it's still available, but then the owner saw that I ordered, and I guess she watches my videos, and she sent me the Scissor Hands too as well. I think this one is sold out, so I don't know if this one is restocking. This one is $45, it looks like this, and then here is your colors absolutely gorgeous and then you have a nice mirror in there let's go ahead and swatch these okay wow look at these shades you guys indie they just kill it with quality if you guys like duochrome shimmers this is stunning again this one you could still pre-order um i'll swatch the other one too just in case you guys are interested if i don't know if it will come back in stock or not but this one is available just absolutely beautiful here is swatches of the scissor hands too again just absolutely beautiful i actually thought they kind of looked similar at first but now swatching them this is definitely more like jewel tone vibes just stunning i cannot wait to put these on the eyes you guys i finally made tree huts pr list i am so excited about this i don't know what it is but i feel like i don't get a ton of pr from perfume brands and body care brands because i also make makeup content i don't know it's like they only want to send to like exclusive accounts or something same with some of the makeup brands i feel like since i do such a variety it's hard for me to get on these lists, but you guys know I am a tree hut fanatic and I literally talk about them all the time. So I felt like this was about damn time, but I'm still very excited. They sent over a couple of their new scrubs here and I actually have both of these, but how cute it says we hope you love our newbies. They do have a total of like four new scrubs, but they sent me their Blue Lagoon. This is a really nice, very fresh beachy scent, perfect for summer. 
and the pink hibiscus which is actually perfect because i actually used this one up already this one was like a walmart exclusive and it's more of a floral scent but very perfect for spring so those are just a couple of the new tree hut scrubs here this is such a cute one too this came from catrice and they made it like a fun themed box so they are promoting their new lip jams i've been seeing these all over social media already and i'm all about a good lip balm lip oil so i'm really excited to try these it says they are a hydrating formula that nourishes the lips it leaves a shiny finish they have shea butter coconut oil and mango butter in the formula and they're supposed to be ultra smooth, non-sticky, with five fruity flavors and only five dollars. Catrice just amazes me at how low their prices are. So they have a bunch of them. I'm not sure if they're supposed to be like super colored or if they're just supposed to be maybe a hint of color. You can find these on Amazon in Catrice, but they sent over all their flavors in these cute little jellies to match up with them. That is just adorable. So it looks like they have peach, watermelon, strawberry mint maybe and then it looks like maybe a blueberry one i'm gonna actually put one on now because i just want to try them out this is the strawberry so they do have just a hint of color it looks like very nice very nice they smell incredible and they feel good on the lips i'm gonna insert a clip of me wearing the strawberry but so far i think these are gonna be a real winner we got a box from Ilya here so they sent over their latest, I think this is their new skincare item. It's called the Bright Start Activated Eye Cream. It has a cooling tip on it. This is a ceramic tip right here. So it is cooling and it looks like it has a little bit of like a peachy almost color to it to brighten. But it feels really good and so smooth. I feel like that literally blurred my hand. Um, so I'm really excited about this. So it looks like it's going to be a good one. I'm always looking for a new eye cream for the morning. So I think this will be great. Okay, so Say Beauty sent me a humongous trunk with their new launch. This was so much fun. I'm just really excited. I recently got on their PR list and I've been loving to try out their line because they feel like they have a lot of really nice products at Sephora. So this even has a little key to kind of unlock it. This is just too cute, you guys, and wow. Like this whole trunk, I definitely am going to store some stuff in here. But basically, they came out with their new kind of skin tint. And it is called the Glowy Super Skin. They sent me a couple shades of this. I do have oily skin, so I'm a little bit nervous about trying this one. But I'm also still really curious about it. This retails for $40. It's available at Say and Sephora, as well as Colt Beauty. And basically, this is 85% serum. So it's mostly your skincare with a little bit of tint to it. So you actually technically don't need to use a primer with this one. And it says 100% your best skin ever, 36 shades of medium buildable coverage so i'm really excited here is the packaging i definitely want to do at least a shorts video or a tiktok on this for sure like right away um and then i'll probably do a testing new makeup on it as well in addition to that they did give us a little bit of extra goodies their base brush to apply it with and their glowy super gel which is kind of like their glowy primer this is actually quite hyped i still need to try it out i probably won't try it with this foundation but definitely with their other skin tint i think it'll be stunning all right let's see what we got from from benefit here looks like we got their new skincare line so I kind of went over this a little bit if you guys saw my new at Ulta video but I think they sent the entire collection it's their pore care from the pore professional so a lot of pore targeting products this is their deep retreat clay mask their smooth sip smoothing moisturizer for pores oh I did not see this at Ulta they have a mask wand um, that you could apply your mask with this is their Speedy Smooth Pore Mask. I cannot wait to try this, their Good Cleanup Pore Purifying Cleanser. They also have a Titan Toned Pore Refining AHA Toning Foam. And lastly, their Get Unblocked Pore Clearing Makeup Removing Cleansing Oil. So I will definitely be trying a couple of these things here. I'm curious to see how it is, um, but yeah, you can find all of their stuff right now at Ulta Beauty. This box is from one of my favorite brands, Kopari, and they sent over their new eye bright cream. So we have another eye cream here, really pretty box. So this again will be a nice morning eye cream. It is their niacinamide and caffeine eye bright cream. This one does not have like a peach tint. It almost has like a greenish tint to it actually, which is kind of fun. Also feels really smooth and hydrating. 
And then they sent me a little mirror. I think this is like a little light up mirror because it came with a cord. So always love the fun little extras too. Cannot wait to try this one and see which eye cream I seem to like better. Tree Hut sent me another package with their new shower gels here. So cute. Even included these fun little stickers, but these are the scents that I got. So they sent me just a random assortment, which I did not own these yet. So very excited. I just have the Tropic Glow and the Watermelon, but now I get to try out their Moroccan Rose new foaming gel wash, as well as their Coco Colada. This will be perfect for the summertime. Thank you Tree Hut for sending those over. These are supposed to be really hydrating. They have avocado, kiwi, and orange oils in the formula. Next we have a box from Peach and Lily and they sent over their Retinol for All Renewing Serum. I don't know if this is a brand new launch or what. Maybe it is but I'm kind of excited. I need to try. I want to try a new retinol. I've just been using tretinoin, but I want to see if there is one just like in the regular market that I can try that doesn't require a prescription. This says it's a breakthrough patent pending technology to smooth lift firm and brighten with a zero irritation. Here is what the bottle looks like, but it's supposed to be 20 times faster and 11 times more effective than traditional retinol. So I think I might switch over and try this one out next. I'm actually almost out of my tretinoin but yeah i'm really excited about this i have never received pr from l'occitane so this was really exciting let's see what they sent over oh this is so fun they sent a bunch of stuff i really thought they were going to only send their cream but they sent a lot of my other favorites but it just says, hi Leah, hope all is well. I wanted to send along some of our fan faves for you to try, especially as we look ahead to the warmer months. Now this is one of my favorites from them. This is their shower oil. It smells incredible. It's so luxurious. It lathers up so nice in the shower. Now I know this is a really expensive line. I'm very curious in trying it out. This is their Immortel Divine Cream. It said it's made with a natural alternative to retinol, which is really interesting. They also have like a bunch of stuff in this line. So we have their Immortel Reset. This is a serum. And this is also in the line. This is a proactive youth skincare enriched emulsion. It says pores, fine lines, and plumpness. And then they also sent, oh, this is nice. One of their hand creams. I really need this right now. My skin is so dry. This is just their dry skin hand cream. So let me know if you guys have tried the L'Occitane skincare, what you guys think. It sounds really, really luxurious and extravagant. So I'm curious to see if it actually like is worth the price tag. Okay, my husband started his truck outside, so it's a little bit loud, but next little package is from Koki. It looks like they sent over some of their brow products. This is another really affordable drugstore brand. These actually have really cool packaging, like at gold packaging, their eyebrow pencil. They sent over a few different shades, chocolate, auburn, dark brown, and blonde. I'll definitely be using the blonde. And usually with my extras now, I've actually been using them for free gifts with all my Poshmark orders. I'll throw in a few things here and there because I just get so much stuff. So that's kind of what I've been doing. It's just been easier for me. But since these are actual shades, I might give them to some friends and family. So these are only $8. Let's check it out. There's a spoolie on one end and then... The product is on the other side. Oh, it's a nice micro tip. I love that. It's really micro. Here is the blonde. It's an actual kind of warm blonde, I would say. I think it will work for me, though. They're also supposed to be smudge proof and waterproof. Definitely going to be trying this out in my next drugstore makeup video. Next, I got a cute little box from Pixie. They sent over, it looks like, some eye patches. How cute. So this is, this is the Nutrify Nourishing Eye Patches to rejuvenate, replenish, and soothe the delicate under eye area. I always like to use these if I didn't get enough sleep. Um, you can use them on like flights so you don't get too puffy or if you just had a bad day and you cried a lot, these can do some depuffing. Okay, this is a huge box. This one came from Urban Decay. This is their new 24-7 inks. So I think they're eyeliners. It says we created the number one eyeliner you already love. Open this box for more chaos proof performance. So they made it a cute little clock, which is fun. So their Urban Decay 24-7 eyeliners are kind of iconic, and now they made new inks, so these are like felt tip pens instead. 
So maybe let's check these out and maybe swatch a couple. I want to try and improve my liquid liner game. Now these honestly kind of remind me of wands. Like they look like Harry Potter wands for some reason. The letter I read, they made this like an easy grip. So you can easily hold it to create the most precise line, which is actually kind of cool. So it looks like a lot of thought went into this. Oh my gosh, this green. Oh my gosh, that is so fun. This is the shade Freak, love that. This is a really fun turquoise called Deep End. I think they have these shades in their regular line. Oh my gosh, the yellow though. This is Mucho Mucho. That one seems new to me. These are stunning. I'm actually really excited. They make me want to try out some fun new eye looks and winged liner looks for spring. So thank you Urban Decay. These seriously look like they're going to be such a hit. Next box is from Briogeo. I got to work with them recently, which was so cool, but they also sent over, I think this is one of their new lines as well, the Color Me Brilliant. This whole line is supposed to protect hair from color fading and, re and keep your color vibrancy longer, so I'm definitely interested in trying this out. It says it has mushroom and bamboo in the formulas, so it has the Color Protect Shampoo and the conditioner. And also they included the Color Protect Primer, which sounds good as well. It's a leave-in cream to prevent color fade and protect hair from heat up to 450 degrees. Love to see that, so really excited for the new Briogeo hair stuff. This line sounds right up my alley. Okay, this box came from Kiehl's. I'm a little late to the game because they sent this for Valentine's Day, but they wrapped it like a present, which is so stinking cute. So this is definitely my kind of PR package because you guys know I'm a body care junkie and it says share the skin love XOXO Kiehl's and inside we have some of their like skin products like body care, which is nice. So for sure I have tried their cream de corpse. This is a really nice moisturizer. It's unscented, but it is so rich and smooth. This looks amazing as well. The butter mask for lips. And it looks like we have a fragrance. This is the original musk. I don't know if I will like this. I might try it though and see. So I'm not really feeling this one. It smells like the typical like powdery, older kind of scent. I'm not really feeling it. So that one's a pass for me, but I definitely will be using the other products included. Next we have Youth to the People. I think we got another eye cream here. <laughs> the month of eye creams I suppose. So this is their new Peptides Plus C Energy Eye Concentrate. Brightens into puffs, fatigued looking eyes, and blurs appearance of fine lines with daily use. It's a gel serum formula. You can use it a.m. and p.m. And this one seems like it almost has more product than the other ones. Oh my gosh, I have so many new eye creams to try out now. Thank you to the people for sending this over. All right, this box is from Revolution, and I've been dying to open this because I really wanted to try these out, but I've been waiting for this unboxing. They sent over their Balm Glow. This is like kind of a dupe for the Jones Road Blush Balms. So I did see these at Ulta in my video. If you guys saw it, there's a bunch of different shades. You can use them for cheeks and lips. It's a cream formula. This is what the packaging looks like, and then you have your balm. They feel really nice. I should have grabbed a darker shade, but yeah, these are so sheer. I almost don't really like that. I don't know. I feel like I'm going to have to use the super dark shades to get any color, and they're quite glossy looking, so I don't know if that's going to work for my oily skin. I feel like I was really hyped up for these, and now I'm just kind of like, wait, I don't know if I'm going to like them. Okay, I grabbed Deep Plum. Let me try swatching this one and see if it's any better. A little bit, but yeah, they are very, very glossy. I hope they're not like sticky on the cheeks. Okay, next box. This is actually from Bliss, and they have a new skincare product here. It says the Mother Load of Radiance. So this is their new Glow Rush Vitamin C Luminous Daily Moisturizer. Actually sounds so nice. Has vitamin C and E shea butter and then squalane in the formula. This will be an awesome day moisturizer. It feels very hydrating, but it's not too heavy. It is quite lightweight, so I think this will be awesome. And it doesn't have that gross like vitamin C smell. This just smells like nothing, so I think I'm really going to like this as well. Okay, last box. This one was huge. I have never got a PR package from this brand before. This is Heritage by Mindy McKnight, and they sent over so many things. Oh my gosh. So this is a hair care line. I'm pretty sure I've seen them at Walmart, but basically... Let me scoot you up. It says dandruff is so 2000 and late. So they made 
an entire early 2000s box which is basically my childhood so I love this so you can send a cassette player you guys I don't even have any cassettes anymore but this is just cool definitely want to keep it display it they also sent a Tamagotchi oh my gosh like how cool is that let's get into the actual hair products here so they're like anti-dandruff line we have their anti-dandruff shampoo for dry flaky scalp I'm gonna make my husband try this one I'm gonna try it too I get dry scalp from eczema but his is super dry and itchy so I'm gonna have him put this to the test we also have their leave-in conditioner for all scalp types I'm always loving a good leave-in this is the perfect dose balancing conditioner for all hair types and then you guys there's even more like fun stuff in here lip smackers these are like coca-cola spray and root beer we also have these cute headbands corduroy headbands but they sent a cute little fanny pack what the heck you guys i know everyone's always been into the lululemon ones but this looks just like the lululemon so that's actually so fun we also have these humongous smarties Another hair product that was in the bottom, the Overnight Scalp Relief Mist. This could be nice. I'm definitely going to have, again, my husband try that out. And this is the Anti-Dandruff Pre-Wash Booster. There's all sorts of goodies in here. We got a Smarties Candy Necklace. I used to love these. This is iconic. If you guys know what this is, let's have your guesses down below. 90s babies you'll know this is a slap bracelet. I remember these always were at the checkout at Walmart and I always would beg my parents to buy me one but a slap bracelet and there's like a little cord for the cassette player but that's everything that's in here thank you heritage for this super fun package oh my goodness i really am excited about this line as well that is everything you guys all the packages i hope you enjoyed i know so many of you guys enjoy seeing these i know it's not for everyone but i do appreciate those who do leave a comment and are excited to watch these when i do film them every other month or so don't forget to let me know what you guys want to see featured in either a trying new makeup or just have my thoughts on in a review coming up like a speed review so let me know but i'm gonna let you guys go and i'll see you in my next video bye guys